If the universe was born out of nothingness, then what exactly is nothing? And who or what created that nothingness? Modern science suggests the universe began around 13.8 billion years ago with a massive explosion. Before that, all matter, energy, even space and time itself were compressed into an incredibly tiny, hot and dense point. That point is known as the singularity. Then, a tremendous explosion occurred. Matter and energy rapidly expanded in an instant, giving rise to the universe we see today. But the real question is, what was there before the Big Bang? If it was nothingness, then what is this nothingness? Instinctively, we might think nothingness means complete emptiness, like a dark, hollow space. But physics tells us otherwise. True nothingness isn't like that. According to quantum mechanics, even seemingly empty space is filled with quantum fluctuations. Even without any matter, there are brief bursts of energy spontaneously creating and destroying particles. This quantum vacuum may be the key to the universe's birth. The quantum origin hypothesis suggests that the universe emerged spontaneously from quantum fluctuations. In other words, the birth of the universe might not have needed an external force, but instead came from internal instability triggering a spontaneous creation. A deeper question is this, did time and space even exist before the Big Bang? General relativity tells us that space and time aren't fixed backdrops but parts of the universe itself. If the universe truly began from a singular point, then before that explosion, time and space might have been meaningless. The birth of the universe was also the birth of time itself. So before it, there was no before at all. It's like asking, what's south of the South Pole? That question doesn't make sense. Because the South Pole is already the southernmost point. Likewise, the singularity may be the starting point of time itself. Nothingness isn't something, it's a state without time or space.